E. So we have uh, Weefa Trainer versus Greninja. Uh, from my from my understanding, this matchup is kind of rough for Weefa Trainer, just because Greninja is like so. Greninja tends to low profile a lot of stuff that the Trainer can do, and there's also Jesus Christ. Very nice. Wants. Very nice. You know, I appreciate the uh, I appreciate the read on the header there that lets the counter. Very nice. It's like, wow, he's gonna mash header. We fit? Get out! Really? Oh my! Are you fit? I'm fit. <laughs> I cannot believe the the fact that the header only hit Greninja's shield because the shield hit. It's so absurd. Okay. Oh no, I'm a judge. And honestly, it's like it's on Xempai to start, to start trying to approach because Jake Runt doesn't really need to bother. You can just throw out Shuriken and counter the uh, the headers if he wants to. It's not that much risk for him to do so. He has a full stock lead, so it's on Xempai to, to make that approach. You do have to remember though that, um, what's it called? Water Shuriken does not hit below the ledge. So there's no reason to like really get up on the ledge until Water Shark can pass through you. Well, there is the fact that if she hangs long enough, she starts doing pull-ups, and she might just put her face into the shuriken. This is a pull her high enough to actually like get hit by She stuff? goes super or not high. <laughs> really? She, she's trying to show off. She's literally flexing. She's trying to do those chin-ups? Yeah. She's like, you couldn't do this in middle school. I can do it now as an adult. A weird, creepy adult. Is Jagron going to be the one to defeat all the Weefa trainers? <laughs> I mean, right now we got even stocks, like, uh, and Senpai exiting on a second. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> He's like, Senpai is just trying to build up some damage. I mean, Jagron's staying at specific angles and just shielding. Specific, expressly to like try to avoid getting hit at all by the heavy headers. Or the, the, not the heavy headers. Ooh. Yeah, now we got Jagron with like a full stock lead, just trying to lap him in percent. Bro, she says all that while fighting, that's what that's. Yeah, I mean, she's really just looking out for everyone's well being. This isn't even a fight, she's just like, why? I just want you to be fit. I just need you to learn how to properly. You, I need you to learn the proper form for. Yeah. But Jagron ah. would be like, no, I will have the chalky milk, you cannot stop me. Yeah. All right, so uh, pretty solid, honestly. Like, if X Empire wants to make something happen, they're gonna have to make it happen pretty soon, cause that was a pretty tough, tough game to to bear. Ooh. Wow, that bounce was unfortunate. All right, guys, we're going down into the caves. They may be a little hazy. Press one if you don't want me to play this song for fighting music, because I am—I no, <laughs> totally understand. We can skip it. <laughs> we, can, we can skip the hazy, mazy cave. I, I see you still proceed to let it play, though. They haven't started fighting. Mm -hmm. I feel when the xylophone starts. Xylophone player really is carrying the song. I, I think it's like every layer. I love every bit of this. <laughs> I just love the fact that they're like drums and fuck drums, xylophones. That's what we play. Freaky beats. We got a sitar, we got the bass guitar, we got some uh, we got some maracas. enjoy having the music playing, actually. I think it's kind of nice to just like listen to something different yeah. in Smash music. Oh boy. 
All right, so let's see. Where are we going? We're going to Smashville. Um, much smaller stage, so maybe uh, we'll be able to, like, you know, add more pressure on. But, I mean, Jagron nice already is showing so much, like, control by even just getting that early jab lock. All right. Jaguar looking for an opportunity to get in. Like, this is the way the X Empire is playing around the platform. He's trying to stay by the edge of it on the opposite side from Jaguar because he oh knows boy. that uh, Greninja's best way to approach is to jump in. Okay. X Empire finally in an edge guard situation. Uh, is he going to blunder it? No. All right. Keep, it keeps it going. I like this. Jaguar may have started off the game uh, a little bit quicker, but X Empire very quickly adapted to it and put on some heavy damage and taking the first stop. Yeah, Jigrunt overcharging that water shark by a lot and taking a sunside to the face. Another one to the face. Yep. Already at 23 damage. Now that's nothing too bad, but I don't necessarily see him dying anytime soon is what I would say. But when you get hit by a down tilt up smash, you're going to have to say All goodbye to that stock. So, evened up. You can see like the way that the uh, the platforms laid out are really is really kind of messed with the way that Jaguar wants to work the matchup. Uh, because X Empire just runs away, he gets onto the platform and he tries to and he tries to force Jaguar to approach. Now, especially now that he has the lead, uh, it's even harder for for Jaguar to to get the hit for the needs. Mm -hmm. Okay. Wow. That did him stomping the ball actually help him get away from the shuriken? Don't even that was weird. So. Anyway, uh, yeah. Now you know Jagron definitely kind of on the defensive here. You know, 130 damage. If she so much as sneezes from a deep breath, uh, he's kind of out of here. The ninja not a very heavy character. Oh boy, Jagrant holding, set, trying to hold center stage, giving it up. I'm surprised that we didn't just see a back air there. I guess he didn't wasn't convinced that he crossed him up, but. Gonna get the forward tilt off the side there. Now, like, this is a pretty much a repeat of the first stock. So, like, 70 damage. Oh, up to 80 now. So if we see the same sort of uh, up smash setup, it could be evened up really quickly. So, I think X Empire is gonna try and be a little bit more wary of that. Ooh, but Jesus. holding out is not what you wanna do there. Going straight into the blast zone. Um, you know, it was kind of questionable if uh, Senpai was going to survive that regardless, but the, uh, the setup was too perfect for Jenkins. Yep. Remember, Smashville also has a high ceiling, so, like, you want to try and go as up as possible there. Oh, yep, up. All right, They're but looking for yeah. some kind of hit to get stuff started. He's just like moving in and out constantly. Kind of just seems that the entire progression of this match so far has just been like, oh, uh, you brought it even? All right, cool, but I'm still in the lead. Uh, X and Fly says. Oh, is that really going to be it? No, okay. So that one close, might. But that's yeah. definitely going to be it. Yeah. Deep breathing. Swimming. Uh, Work hard to tone that tummy. See, she's zen. Tone that tummy. You see this? She's so encouraging. Be like water. <laughs> Be like water. Boom. She's so zen. <laughs> I'm about the SM64 between games. Uh, this is not on purpose. It's just happening. <laughs> it's just happening. You have it on shuffle, right? Yeah, I think of so. Of course you do. <laughs> It is foretold. It's definitely on shuffle, yes. Win this for the CV. What does oh, okay. CV stand for? Um, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure in the UK that's what they call resume. 
Yeah, it is definitely a cover letter. Curriculum Vitae. Or Vitae? Course of Life. Ooh, Blends. all right, all right. Now this game's gonna get spicy, all right? Who <laughs> is freeform jazz enough? All right, this is when you're gonna get your mix up. This is when you get unpredictable. Just like the beat, just like the melody here. You don't know what's gonna be happening. Happening. Ugh. Oh man, how's Jing we're gonna get in? On beat, that's what he's like gonna get in. Ooh, 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 ooh. This match feels like a boss fight right now, I'm gonna be honest. Oh! Alright, pretty good, pretty good. Alright, bit of a hectic there, uh, off ga off stage game right there. Almost hey, Jager, wanted to try to push Senpai up, but not actually managed to hit him near the water. Alright. Okay. And then you just. <sighs> so I want to see Jagran try to disengage from X Empire, just try to stay in the general airspace, but it's not possible. They, they just can't Until find. Deep breathing runs yeah, out. They can't find an opening. They're having a really difficult time of just like they don't want to overextend. They both know like what they've been able to do to each other at this point. Ooh, almost right, saw that. I like that. the fact. That you see, like the, in the moment that deep breathing ran out, like Jagran just completely changed gears. Yeah. Two offense again. Careful, careful, careful. Ah! Whoa. Nice air stall with the shuriken. Wow. Uh. <laughs> this is so stressful right now. Oh my oh. god! Oh my! I thought really? that was Jay Grunt's forward air, but in fact it was X Empire's forward tilt. From behind? Yeah. Yeah, it didn't even hit up. Yeah. It was forward enough for the forward hitbox still to hit. Crazy. Oh, he, he's trying to, he's getting a little bit reachy here. And you're going to want that kill, man. He's okay. definitely kind of fishing for right now. And, you know, when you go fishing, uh, don't be surprised when you hatch nothing. All right. So... I, honestly, not too bad damage control. Jay Grunt uh, able to seal up the stock while only taking 50 damage. That's really nothing. Uh, he can definitely even it up. Uh, capitalize on a few hits. Win the win the next few exchanges. He could uh, even it up or be in the lead even so. Whoa, okay. But right now, Exxon by just putting up like a, a near impenetrable wall. But Jay Grunt finally finding a crack in the opening there. Yeah, like that. It just even, it's almost even now. Yeah. This isn't the first time Water Shuriken actually worked out in Jacob's favor. Like for the past two matches. Alright, perfectly even game. Uh, will Jagron be the first Ooh. one to take the stock this time, or right. will he get hit off the stage and be put into a terrible situation again? Yeah, that was bad DI again. He's just not ready for it. I think he's just trying to do, like, you know, like kind of veer backwards to land forward air or something, and so he's just already holding the direction he's going to get hit. All right. <sighs> Jagran just loves to go for those shadows and it's like super high, hoping that they're recovering high. Ooh. Really good dash attack forward, and Jagran takes the lead for the first time this game. All right. And if he can manage to turn this into a into a uh, win, that into another stock, it might be it. He needs a bit of a lead here. Yeah. Let's see what Senpai able to do right now. Uh, okay. Uh, really taking advantage of that like burst range. Is he such a fast character? <gasps> that's my. Oh, that's it. No! Yeah. Very nice. Very clutch. Jagron was like, I need to make something happen, and I have to make it happen right now. Uh, beginning to pick up the pace with the music. Perfect. All right, that was actually that was a good way from Jagron. I like that a lot. Very nice. All right, and with that, uh, he knocks X Senpai into loser. He moves on into winner semis, where Jonathan G is waiting. Uh, it's going to be a best of five set for winter semi for the, all the sets going forward. Very close. Cool. I kind of, that was, I, I like the fact that uh, the Jay Grunt was just like, all right, this is my chance. I can become, like, he kept teasing that he's going to go like super aggro off stage, but then that's the one time he went all in and it really paid Actually off. Actually did it, yeah. I'm just like, I need to make this. I need this, like, I need the W right now. If I don't, I feel like this is going to slip away from me. Boom, boom. 
Very nice. And that feeling when that wouldn't have worked if uh, if X Empire just air 